Hey everyone, Alex Camilio here, and this week we have a topic that could significantly impact your business, whether you're out there cold calling prospects or trying to follow up with your clients. And what is it you might ask? Well, if you're anything like me, over the last 6 to 12 months, you have seen an absolutely inordinate amount of spam calls. You know the ones, you see the number and you immediately know you don't want to pick up. Or if you do pick up, you are off the phone with them within seconds because you know that it's a spam call. Well, it has been happening so much recently that both Google and Apple decided that they were going to take a stab at the problem. So Google started implementing all of these features where if you don't know the number or it's suspected to be spam, it shows up as a big red background on your screen that makes you super unlikely to answer it. Apple, on the other hand, went a step further, and they've decided to add a feature where if someone is not in your contact database, is not saved in your contacts, they get sent immediately to voicemail, and it doesn't even ring on your phone. So what that means is that for both cold calling, as well as trying to follow up with your clients, it has become more important than ever to follow up in a way that first of all gets seen, but also make sure that you end up in someone's contact database. And that's what our article is about today and this week is those two steps. First of all, the few simple steps you can do to follow up via text message, but more importantly, how you can easily get into someone's contact information. So when you're following up with that client, with that prospect, they're going to know it's you and be a lot more likely to answer the phone. Now we give you a few free options as well as a paid option that I use in the article. The free options are to do something like create a VCF or what's called a V card. Now these V cards are free. They're online. We give you some resources to create it, but they're not the be all end all. A lot of times they don't transfer quite correctly. They're a little clunky to use. They're just, they're not the best option. Plus, they don't update, they don't consolidate all of your information in one place and keep being updated as time goes on. If someone has an old V card from you, that old information just stays like it is. They never get that new. There's never any updated sort of information. Now, there's also a paid option. This is something I use. It's called Savvy Card. And it is a great paid option. Um, it automatically prompts people to add their contact information to their phone when they go to it. It is a great digital business card. You can use it in signatures. You can use it on your website. You can, you can use it all over the place. And we have some great examples on how to use it there. But it is not just a business card. It allows you to add your local partners and vendors, and it even integrates into a number of MLSs throughout the country for realtors specifically. So definitely ask them about that. Um, but like I said, it is a tool that I use. I use it in my business. It is awesome in terms of getting people to make sure that they integrate and use your contact information and that you will get through to them on their phone. Now, as usual, we go even a step further and we are giving out a handout today with five free scripts. Those are free scripts that we have built over the last 20 plus years at the organization. Um, and we know work to make sure that you have that correct ask to get into someone's phone as that trusted resource. Because, well, think about it this way. Wouldn't you rather be in a list of all of their friends and family as opposed to just a random real estate agent out there in the world. I know I would be. So that being said, absolutely check it out. We're giving away five free scripts this week so you can make sure to get into their contacts. We are given a step-by-step -step away so you can either go create a free business card um, or a free digital business card or use the savvy card option, which is what I use and is absolutely incredible. Um, and there are a whole bunch of extra benefits uh, and things you can take away from the article as well. So I would highly suggest checking it out. This has been Alex Camilio, CEO of the Agent Inner Circle. Thank you so much. If you have any questions, suggestions, ideas, ways that you use this or ways that you get into someone's contact information, please let us know. We always love hearing from you. And there may be even a gift in store. So again, Alex Camilio, signing out.